Forests provide essential resources for the planet. When they're destroyed, entire ecosystems can go into shock. 2011 has been declared by the United Nations to be the International Year of Forests. They cover a third of the planet's landmass and provide over one and a half billion people with a livelihood. The United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization partnered with the Philippines government to promote ANR as a way of regenerating the forests. The ANR technique is simple and above all cost effective. When a small tree is located, a ring is weeded around it and the surrounding grass is pressed down. Finally, nearby grass is cut away so sunlight can penetrate the area and trees can grow quickly. All these little fellows that are trying to grow get a chance to grow and you can see the result. This is only two years old. And how many species have you got here? All native species. As people begin to understand the fragility of our natural systems, they're flocking to see forests. This means new sources of income, along with increased possibilities for ecotourism. Communities also benefit from the forest products they're able to collect. The tropical pandanus plant is used both as food and to make dozens of household products. These women use it to make baskets, now on sale throughout the Philippines. It's an important source of income and it's directly tied to the state of the surrounding forests. The United Nations International Year of Forests aims to raise awareness of the fact that healthy forests are an important part of guaranteeing sustainable development. Regeneration projects help to ensure that we can continue to celebrate forests well into the future.